Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier and in my this particular video I am going to discuss some concepts related to two data types widely used in image processing. One is double data type, another one is unsigned integer data type. Okay, so here I have written the same code which I have used for showing the addition of two images. Okay, CLC clear all close all warning off and then uh, taken two images from MATLAB database itself no need to import separately one is rice.png another one is cameraman.tif then I am adding these two images these two images have same size 256 cross 256 you can check using size of i and size of j okay and that output of addition of two images I am storing in this output variable and I am writing here I am show output so now if I run this whole code I will be having addition of two images cameraman and rice which effect can be clearly shown here ok now see what is this data type of this ij and output that is our cameraman.tif rice.png and the output having what data type let us check whose i this is unsigned integer data type ok alright whose j this is also unsigned integer data type whose output okay this is also unsigned integer data type so what is speciality about this unsigned integer data type actually this unsigned integer data type works in different way compared to normal arithmetic okay what the normal arithmetic says 56 plus 2 suppose uh, let me take 256 okay what is this output 312 right now what I will do unsigned integer I will write uint 8 of 56 plus 256 see I will be getting output as 255 ok which is not actually 312 why this is happening because in unsigned integer you can unsigned integer of 8 bit representation maximum value which you can represent that is 255 so if the arithmetic result exceeds 255 it will map to 255 okay there is kind of clipping it is performing right but in case of double data type this will not happen see double data type is normally how we uh, used to do in normal arithmetic case that is 56 plus 256 it is 312 okay so this is the fundamental difference in between double and unsigned integer 8 which you use widely as data type in image processing and one more thing very very important in unsigned integer 8 this data type 0 indicates black or completely dark and 255 indicates white okay that is brighter color and in case of double data type 0 indicates black and 1 indicates basically white okay that is as you move from 0 to 1 the image will become whiter and whiter so if you if you take any value which is higher than 1 that is actually white in double data type but for unsigned integer 8 data type it is not like that because for unsigned integer 8 data type 255 near to 255 values are whiter and 0 is black okay remember this difference let me show you the difference also here okay so here what we have done we have done arithmetic based on unsigned integer because we have not typecast it to double and our images are by default unsigned integer 8 8 bit representation so what i will do i will convert this to double data type and same goes for the cameraman image also okay try to understand this part very very important so now our arithmetic will happen based on which data type based on double data type remember this now if i run this whole code okay control a evaluate selection i'll be having one white image see previously we were getting addition of cameraman.tif and rice.png but now we are getting completely white image due to typecasting to double now you may think why this is happening the reason is very simple previously we have done calculation based on unsigned integer but now we are doing based on double when we are adding two double data here i and j let me show you mean of mean of i 
which is 40 okay so minimum intensity level present in our first image is 40 and mean of mean of j is 7 okay so minimum possible sum of element of i and j is 40 plus 7 that is 47 if you consider double data type what i have told you Hmm. 1 near to 1 that is brighter and greater than 1 any value you take that is completely white only. So minimum of i is 40 minimum of j is 7 so when you add at least minimum value you will be getting 47 right. So obviously in case of double data type everything will be white as output because that is in double data type working and the fundamental principle of double data type is 0 is black near to 1 everything is white, more than 1 everything is white, any value lesser than 0 is black, like that it works, right? So for double data type, it is like this. Now, same image will work if you just again typecast to UINT8, okay? So what we are doing, our basically addition result it is giving in double data. So, uh, suppose it is exceeding 255 value, then also no problem in double data type arithmetic. But when you are using unsigned integer 8, what will happen? As a result, all the values greater than 255 will be mapped to 255. And in case of unsigned integer, this will also happen that uh, the values close to 255 is basically white and values close to 0 are basically dark. Okay. So now if I run this whole code, I will be again getting my original output which is addition of cameraman.tif and rice.png. Okay, so I hope the fundamental difference in between unsigned integer and uh, double data type you have understood because these are widely used but very much confusing uh, sometimes to many students. So remember only these two points, double data type, our point of interest will be from 0 to 1. 0 means black. 1 means white, more than 1 any value is white, less than 0 or near to 0, near to zero any, value, any value is black, okay. Then in case of unsigned integer 8-bit representation, value ranges from 0 to 255, near to 255 values are white, near to 0 values are black and if your value uh, while doing arithmetic operation, if your value exceeds 255, it will map to 255, that's all, this is all. Now you may think, okay fine, so obviously in image processing mostly we require this unsigned integer type, anywhere we require this double data type directly, yes, many places, there are lots of algorithms where we require this, like I am showing one example code of bit plane slicing which I will be discussing in my next upcoming videos, okay, so in case of unsigned integer 8 bit representation as you know that each pixel having intensity which is represented as 8 bit binary number that is 0 is represented by 8 zeros and 255 is represented by 8 ones okay so there are msb there are lsb so if you extract one one only one bit intensity level okay that is only take all the msb of intensity level or all the fifth bit or all the fourth bit or all the lsb okay so what will happen if you do like that you will be only having zeros and ones in their binary representation, right? So in that case, to show that image, we will directly use double data type. Like here, I have written the code for the time being. You will not understand this, but while I when I will discuss bit plane slicing, you will be understanding. So if you take all the LSB of the intensity levels present in our image, we will be having this. Then second bit plane like this, third bit plane like this. MSB will look like this. Okay, so. Let me just show you one particular bit plane. R4 if I click and enter, see some 0, 1 combination we are getting, right? Now to represent this image, what we will do? We are we can use double, okay? So this data type whose R4 is already in double, right? Because while programming, we have converted our image to double. See, using double of A. From unsigned integer to double, we are converting. Now, this image can be shown easily using double data type, which is looks like this. That is LSB uh, part if you take and if you show as image, you will be having this. But, suppose I am converting this R4 equal to 
unsigned integer okay u i n t 8 of r4 okay that is unsigned integer 8 bit representation if we do and if we run i, I am sure for i will be having completely black image now you may think why idea is very simple see in our r4 what are the elements 0 and 1 right because binary representation only having 0 and 1 so if you extract any bit plane maybe lsb maybe fifth bit maybe fourth bit maybe third bit maybe msb does not matter you will be having only elements as zeros and one and in unsigned integer what happens what i have told you zero means blackish part near to zero also black that is dark and as you move towards 255 you will, your image will become brighter that is white okay so as our r4 all the elements are zero and one only so in unsigned uh, integer 8 bit representation it will appear as completely black but, but the same image in double data type will look uh, having some black white combination binary image because in case of double data type zero means black and one means white okay so this is the fundamental difference in between unsigned integer 8 and double data type okay i hope the concept of unsigned integer 8 bit representation and double is clear to you so this is all for my this video thank you for watching